telling you. This magazine says we can have a lovely home, and it says that it doesn't cost very much money. All it takes is a decorator's eye, which I have, according to Professor LeVar. Professor LeVar? How much, Peg? You're just gonna love him, Al. He is the professor at the Cook County School of Interior Design, of which I am now enrolled. How much, Peg? Oof, I feel so good. $2,000. <laughs> I have finally found my calling, and I knew you'd be happy for me, honey. Honey. <laughs> Watch out. Let me get your tongue. <laughs> you spent $2,000 on a decorating school? Uh-huh. Well, it must be my fault. Sure, I'll take the blame. I didn't have to say I do. <laughs> I could have just taken one of your uncle's shotgun blasts in the back and be done with it. But then, honey, we couldn't have had that great reception. You know, where your father whispered in my ear, if you like my son, I'm twice as fun. <laughs> oh, come on, Al. Go with me on this decorating thing. I'm really good at it. You'll see tomorrow. My homework assignment is to make one room in this house breathtakingly beautiful. Peg, this is my house. If you want it to look better, dust. <laughs> if you want it to smell better, cook. If you want it to be happy, leave. <laughs> but do not touch this house. I am not a man happy with change. Well, that explains your job and your underwear. <laughs> Peg, I'm warning you, touch not a hair in this house. Do not redecorate. I won't. A pox on you. Like I noticed. <laughs> Seems normal. <laughs> normal. Let me check upstairs. She listened to me. It's normal. <laughs> <laughs> Son, I'm glad you're here. I want to talk to you about being a man. See, son, a man. I know what you're getting at. You think I want to be home early on a Friday night? You think I'm not trying desperately to get a date? Do you think I like hearing the chants, bud, bud, alone he'll sit, bud, bud, will touch no... I don't want to talk about you! I want to talk about my great victory over your mother. Revel with me, son. She listened to me. I put my foot down, and your mother listened to me. And you know why? Because I am the man, the chief, the king, the boss. Bob's big boy with fries, extra cheese, maybe a little bacon. God, I'm hungry. But anyway, bud, always remember that the man is the boss. Because the man, and it's proven the world over, any country you go to, no matter what it is, there's always a word for man. <laughs> Dad, are you absolutely sure you're my real father? Yes. Don't you know I called for an immediate blood test? <laughs> Son, now I'm going to go celebrate my victory the way a man celebrates his victory. Ah! Thank <laughs> you.